Hamilton scoffed at the facts of the case that he targeted, stalked, and then bludgeoned 76 year old Robert Sharp to death in his home during a robbery last June. Hamilton set the body and house on fire to cover the crime. I'm sorry for their loss. I'm sorry for your loss. But I didn't do none of this. All I did, all I'm guilty of is pop, uh, possession of stolen property. An attorney called him a thug for the Lord. His daughter dubbed him the rescue machine. To those who loved him, he was a hero, a tough, tenacious, cantankerous, lovable hero, a proud Marine who took to heart, both on and off the bench, the motto, leave no one behind. To his critics, he was a bleeding heart liberal on the notorious Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals, a would-be social engineer, a judicial activist who ruled with his heart instead of his head. He was a judge for over 50 years. When he died, still on the bench at 94, it was said, in the field of law and public interest, there are stars, there are superstars, and then there's Harry Pragerson. I lived to tell the truth. Typically, we don't reveal the names or faces of sexual assault victims, but Heidi Damon asked us to show hers. Overall, I feel great. See, you're already ashamed. You can't even look at me. Javon Cooper was just 16 years old when he attacked Heidi in an Ybor City parking garage two years ago. She was choked until she blacked out and later woke up naked from the waist down. Being 20 years old, I want to um, be a man and take, it, take responsibility for my actions. Actions that authorities say terrorized an East Point townhome community that included rapes, armed robberies, kidnapping, and aggravated assaults in September 2015. One victim described seeing Young when he entered her family's home. This is a young man coming to the door for the gun. I said, oh my God, it's a robber.